All right, here we are, part three of the Cummins project. Um, it's been slow, weather's not been great, and I'm not in a super big hurry, but we have flipped off the rusted out cab, and it was very bad. This cab mount is movable. You don't need a floorboard or rockers in that matter. This side's a little worse. That cab mount literally fell off of here whenever the cab was flipped off. The whole floor is just kind of gone. The frame, frame is not much better. I think I might have covered this before, but it's got some holes in it. Some serious rottage issues going on. I mean, all of this scaling and stuff is is just been here since I got it. Like, I'm, I'm not purposely put it in there or anything. It, it's just it's just done this on its own over time, and quite the quite the mess. See up front here. That was about to break off the front core support mount, and up in under here. The whole bottom of the frame is rusted out. It's nothing solid there. But none of that matters. We don't need the cab. We don't need the frame. This is all we need. Glorious P-Pump 12 out. Does have an automatic on it but and transfer case, but all seems all right. I'm using the engine transmission transfer case front and rear axles given this front spring uh whatever they're called where the spring sits is okay for some reason this spring is not in its uh home but yeah whatever's gonna have to do a lot of cleaning next thing i'm doing i'm gonna roll it over closer to some water wash it off really well and i'm gonna try to clean it um, clean it, pull it, reseal it completely, top to bottom. Wait on that guy to go back. Probably have to replace some parts, but as I've probably said before, I have a frame, another four wheel drive frame with minimal rust here at the back. I'm going to completely recoat it. That way it's all good to go. Big old scrap pile. And then I'm using this truck for the body. It's a gas truck. It's got a different door on there. Because I can. Using the bed, a uh, cab. And then this truck is new. 2001 2500 gas truck with a five speed in it as a light duty NV4500 that I'm planning to swap into my other running driving gas truck. They both have 360s. This one is seized up, no title, unfortunately. But it's a really solid truck. It's got a Dana something something eight lug rear axle. I'm gonna swap out the the front eight lug hubs. I'm gonna swap out the rear axle and the manual and all the related components and put it over onto this truck. It's just a five lug truck. I think it'll be a pretty cool swap once it's done. And then I'm using this hood and fenders for the Cummins project. And then I'll just part out the rest. But yeah, that's the update. Slow and steady. I'm not in a hurry. Got a lot of scrap to haul off. But we have our frame. We have our body. And we have a drivetrain. So we'll get there one day. Got to haul off that pile of scrap. But yeah, that's it.
part three of the Cummins build, slowly but surely.